loves welcome to my channel in today's video i will be doing lip swatches as well as a review on the jlb cosmetics ultra shine five piece vamp rich satin lip gloss set Ooh, vamp um i picked this up from dd's Dee discounts for seven dollars and i was really excited to try these lip glosses out just look at the arrangement of the colors so, so pretty. I've really been hitting the jackpot um, at Burlington as well as Dee Dee's when it comes to these lip sets. And I actually have one more of these lip swatching uh, review videos for you loves before um, I'm going to review a lot of eyeshadow because I've been shopping online. Anywho, here is one of them and I actually think this one is, this one's number four. Really pretty. Alright loves, so if you're interested in seeing how these look on the lips as well as my full length review at the end of this video, then just keep watching. Number one, which is one of my favorite shades in this set, is a Milk Chocolate Brown. Number two is a bluish gray, and unlike the other four, it's not nearly as pigmented. A similar color to number two is the Nikka K Lip Shine Liquid Lipstick in Payne's Gray. Number three is a gorgeous purple and another one of my favorites from this collection. Number four is a really pretty plum shade. It's the perfect mixture of purple and brown. The last shade in the collection, number five, is a deep red wine. All right, loves, now that you've seen all of the lip glosses in action, it's time for my final thoughts on the JBL Ultra Shine Five Piece Vamp Lip Gloss Set. Alright loves, starting off with pigmentation first, I think overall the JLB Vamp lip glosses have pretty nice pigmentation. As you can see, it looks very nice and opaque on the lips. All of them except number two, which is like the navy bluish gray one. Um, it's a really pretty color, but it wasn't as opaque as the other four. It wasn't even as opaque as it looks on the outside of the tube. That's why I referenced the Nikka K Lip Shine in the shade Payne's Gray. They're basically the same color except this dries down matte. Oh, excuse me, it dries down matte. But I definitely recommend if you're looking for a shade like this that you check out the Nikka K Lip Shine in Payne's Gray. All right, so pigmentation overall, pretty good. Um, let's talk about how they feel on the lips. They're not sticky, yay! These lip glosses are not sticky. They feel really nice on the lips, uh, not gunky, very lightweight. You could easily top a lip liner or a lipstick with them. And let's see what else. Oh, the price, $7. Okay, honestly, I like all five of them, even number two, with it not being as pigmented as the other four, I still like it as a topper for a different lip product. So I think it's worth the $7 because overall you get five gorgeous shades. If you're into the deep, dark shades year round like I am, then $7 is an amazing deal um, for the shade range that you get. And they're all different. So yes, I definitely recommend the JLB Cosmetics. Let me see, it's a long name. <laughs> Ultra Shine Five Piece Vamp Rich Satin Lip Gloss Set. If you can find it, that's what the front looks like. And again, I picked it up from Dee Dee's Discounts for $7, but I know that uh, Burlington also carries JLB Cosmetics, so if you can't find it at one, definitely check out the other. And overall, I recommend this to you loves. 
got another winner! Yay! I'm so excited. Um, like I said in the intro, I have one more lip swatch slash review video on another set that I picked up from Dee Dee's Discount, so be on the lookout for that video. Um, go ahead and drop a comment down below telling me what you thought. I will put this down below in the description if I can find a link to it. Um, that will be down below in the description as well, so definitely make sure you go ahead and check that out. And until next time, bye loves!